Uh, welcome back guys. Uh, so since it has been a while since you've seen the basement, the last time you were here, you pretty much were seeing the flooring. You can take a look here, all the way down. But since then, I have done a little baseboards. I've got some doors that we're putting in. So the only thing I haven't gotten to, pretty much the whole basement is done. Can you see yourself? I'm in the mirror. <laughs> the only thing I haven't done is the, I still got to put the transition pieces in. Um, that'll take care of that. I had to up, undercut the door so it would fit. Um, but all the trim around the door. Uh, the only thing that hasn't been done yet is it needs painted. I decided to go with black painted doors. Um, I probably shouldn't lean this one on the wall because <laughs> it's a little stuck. It may have been stuck and there may be a black line, but We'll say that later, that way Emily doesn't actually see it. I'm right so, here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, pretty much the same sprayer that I did the ceiling with, I'm spraying the doors with. It takes like two seconds. The same paint. Um, we initially tried doing a gloss paint on the doors. Bad idea. Mm -hmm. It looks like the doors were wet. Originally up here, Emily can show you, I was going to put a border trim all the way around the top. So that's why it's not finished. The screw holes and all that they're not finished because what was the point if i was going to put trim around it well I'm actually i'm thinking i'm just going to fill them in sand it paint it and call it done for it now barn slider doors have arrived just the hardware right here i'm going to have to build those for another video for you guys um but yeah so it's 13 foot uh opening uh well six foot opening but the doors once they're open to be and then 13 foot, that's where my track is. Yep, so that way it... Here, and then over here. So he's got to build those yet. Yeah, so um, that way when they open up, the whole opening of six foot will be open. Mm -hmm. Just so how you guys see it right now. This is the first door that we painted right here. This is the one that turned out super, super glossy. Yeah, so if you want to see what the gloss looks like, yeah, that Hopefully. was how it uh, initially. Yeah, that was how it initially <laughs> so, turned out, and it looked that wet. Side and so we went with the flat black. Does it show it? Yep, it okay. looks a lot better. Okay, so so I know it's kind of a bold statement, but like the black doors, black interior doors are kind of like in right now, and I thought it would go good with the, with the ceiling. ceiling. Just kind of like tie yeah. it all together, good like color scheme, and then he still is hesitant on painting these black. Yeah, let me know in the but, comments, should these go black or white? Black, because, I mean, all the other doors are black now. So now so, we have to commit, right? This is my office. I think they'll look good. Okay. Oh, you didn't show them the carpet. The tack strips, putting the tack strips down. I kept hitting my hands, thump. Trying to nail a tack strip into concrete is not easy to do. It keeps popping out. You gotta really freaking smack it. Ow! <laughs> um, I got it done. I got the carpet all in one piece right here. You want to show them this? Yep. This may not be a big deal for you, but I didn't want any seams here at all. So this entire closet and out there is completely one solid thing. I did it all. Me and my dad. Um, this door is not painted yet. Right. That's the white. Uh, so we're going to paint that one black. And then, like I showed you guys, we're going to paint those black. He's just worried about painting them black. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But I think it'll honestly look good. It'll go. I, I won't be spraying the these ones. I'll probably have to hand brush these ones. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. We'll see. But I'll, it's still got plastic on it, so that way I don't have to tape it off. Which makes it nice. A lot nicer. And then I'll put the handles on. I got the little, the little ball things are up here, but I got to chisel out where they go to put the little bracket in. The basement has finally come to a, a completion, 95% I'd say. Um, we don't really want to buy furniture down here <laughs> because we are cheap and we really haven't figured out if we're going to stay here or not. Long term. I think this is a sweet gym. All my gym equipment's over there. It's a full freaking gym. If you put that in here, I mean, that's like a state-of-the-art gym at the house. 
for me not to use. It'll just sit in here and look pretty. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, that's about it. Um, let me know what you all think. Uh, it's a work in progress. It's coming to an end, and I okay. can't wait for it to be done. <laughs> and I'm sure Emily can't wait either. All the long hours of me coming home, going right to the basement and doing something. But uh, guys, if you would, like, share, and subscribe, and keep an eye out for more videos from me. Uh, right now, probably about once a month until I get things going back again. Uh -huh.